What up, YouTube? This is Geo Stealth R1, and as you can see, I have a box. Now, this is going to be my first low CRC, and um, I have really thought about which low C I was going to get initially. If you go upon the history of my channel, my first low C car truck should have been the 5T, which I never got, never got it, and I'm sad to say, um, I just never got it. And I ended up uh, speaking with one of my boys, uh, Chris, every day RC, and he said to me, he goes, yo, this is, uh, this is something uh, good for you to get. And I'm like, really? Legitly? Is, is this, is this, is this the one? He was like, yeah, man, this, this is the one to go. So, uh, I'm going to go through all the quick knickknacks of me unboxing this right now. And by the time, um, you get to see the next part of this, it'll be unboxed. There we go. So, uh, <laughs> so pretty much this box is very massive. Um, I ended up going with the green edition. It does give me the battery and charger. I do have an updated charger for this, but um, I'm just gonna go, you guys have seen these unboxing videos many a times, and basically what you guys are looking for me to do is customizing these RC stuff. Now, I kind of messed up, and I, and I wanna tell you why. All right, give me one second. So yeah, so this is primarily the bike right now. Um, you guys always enjoy watching my channel. So, don't know which one I'm gonna go with, but this is the yellow aftermarket um, fairings, plastics, whichever you wanna call them. Uh, I'm not even gonna go into the part list like I usually do. Uh, Geo Stealth for black. Ended up getting the black one as well. Um, the company I'm gonna go with is uh, Trell uh, for all my aluminum parts, but I just started getting murdered out tires right now, front and rear. Uh, I had to make sure my shorty was black, blacked out, so got him an outfit uh, just in case. If I'm going with the yellow, make sure he's dressed up appropriately for that, and I got the green edition right there. Also, we gotta do that carbon fiber, you know what's up. We gotta put that in there. You guys always enjoy me doing the customized parts for this. I try to get as much stuff as there. I'm probably gonna return these and go specifically with the Trail brand so the orange doesn't um, mix up. And then possibly, or maybe I just keep these, and these are the disc brakes. Not too sure why I got this, but I know it was an aftermarket part, aluminum compound gear. Um, got that piece and not sure why I bought this, but I bought it anyway. Titanium hinge pins. So here's where we're at. I'm gonna come across and tell you I'm going to be doing full upgrades on this and hopefully I'll be able to bash uh, with a few guys out in Long Island. So um, stay tuned for all the updates, upgrades, everything I'm gonna be doing, checking out the bike, seeing exactly what the bike does. You guys have pretty much have seen so many videos right now that have you know, come across and taught you everything about this bike before I could even try to even teach you anything. But the one thing I'm noticing out there is that not many people really customize, you know, this RC bike, which, you know, realistically speaking, if you look at this bike on the streets, like the real one, you know, everybody hooks it up. So uh, I'm working with a few companies to see if I can get the update. Um, well, We'll see what happens. Anyway, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, stay tuned for up and coming videos. And to all my fellas up on YouTube, later.